guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Susanna and I am so glad to have you guys here I hope the lighting isn't let me fix that I don't know if that I hope that helped I hope that didn't make it worse but I hope the lighting isn't super weird right now I am filming for the first time at night because I am about to film the portion of this video where I show you guys my skincare so it's gonna be a very fun video today we have a vlog where you get to meet my family I also end up playing a semi funny prank on no it's pretty funny a prank on my mom which is maybe slightly immature but it was really funny so <laughs> we did it anyway and I also show you guys my Memorial Day meal which includes a Cuban burger which is delicious and I'll kind of show you the recipe in this video so make sure you stay tuned for that it's so good like honestly one of the best burgers I've ever had in my life so yeah, today was just a really fun day with the family and I'm so excited to take you guys along on the adventure and um, for lots of laughter and yummy food. And then I cannot wait to show you kind of my little skincare routine and what I do every evening to keep a, a decent complexion as good as I can do. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the video. All right, so we are heading to Walmart. <laughs> but of course, we got the masks. Look how cute this one is. It has the lemons on it from Indigo. But we are going to get, <laughs> what? <laughs> He's laughing at me. <laughs> we are going to Walmart to get some food for Memorial Day. And then I'm going to take it over my parents, to my parents, and we're gonna cook and all that stuff and yeah so it'll be fun we've had we've had a fun day so far we've gone to the pool and we played some pool mm -hmm. so it's been it's been a good day so going to Walmart and then we'll be going to the parents house so I am back at home I am done with Walmart but I did not want to leave honey in my car and I'm wanting to take her over to my parents house so I am home now and I'm gonna pick up honey and then we are going to head over. And unfortunately Matthew can't come because he needs to get ready for the work day tomorrow. I think he has a really busy one. So he's on his way home. So yeah, I'm excited. We're gonna go hang out with the parents a little bit. And then tonight I will show you my get unready with me. So I'll show you what that process looks like. Also, something that I kind of want to do that I think will be honestly a little bit funny and possibly slightly immature, but I'm kind of okay with that. So I'm not a huge fan of TikTok, honestly, unpopular opinion, but honestly, it's just because I don't want to download it and then become addicted to it. So I just haven't downloaded it. Anyway, I have heard that there is a trend going around where you pour a glass of like juice or something and you have it secretly filming and you pour it in front of your mom, but then you just keep pouring and pouring and then it starts to overflow and you just have to like, oh, nothing is going on. No big deal. And you kind of capture her reaction. So honestly, I think that might be something kind of fun to do tonight so again partially immature also I think it'll be fun so I don't really care so I think I might try that maybe that'll be fun I don't know I'm excited to see her reaction okay so I'm gonna go ahead and get honey and then we are going to hop in my car and head over to the parents for Memorial Day dinner all right honey it's time to go grandma and grandpa's are you excited are you excited she's a super focused on chewing up her ball but i want to show you guys it's so cute she's so good whenever i try to put her harness on her okay come on honey come on we're gonna put on your harness oh doing this one-handed is kind of difficult but look how good she is she's just sitting there okay i'm gonna have to put the camera down because this is not working <laughs> So we are officially at my mom and dad's, chilling out on the porch, about to start the grilling process. Honey is very happy to see her grandpa. So apparently my dog got bit by a copperhead last night. She's okay. I think dogs handle snake venom a lot better than people do, but kind of scary. Apparently her neck started to swell a lot and she started to like salivate a lot and my parents took her to the hospital or the vet hospital last night so I'm glad she's okay it's kind of sad but yeah that's 
that's country living for you. I'll give you guys a little view of country living. So this is the backyard. Bear just ventured back there. Oh, there she is. See, she's okay. Running and frolicking and being all happy. <laughs> Hi, Bear! Bear! Are you okay? Did you get bit by a snake? Oh, oh yeah, I can kind of see. I haven't seen her until now. Underneath her neck is kind of swollen. You okay? So yeah, that's Arkansas. Isn't Arkansas beautiful? I just, I love it out here. <gasps> oh, bear. Are you, oh, look at her little neck. Are you okay, baby? Oh, yeah, that's bad. You okay? Sweet puppy. This wouldn't be the first time one of our dogs got bit by a snake, but they are definitely more resilient against the venom. Where are you going? I wanna hang out. Come on, bear. She's like, no, I wanna get out, I smell food. Also, dinner menu for tonight is pretty delicious. We are going to be making, ooh, that lighting though, one second. That's much better. We are going to be making some Cuban burgers. So those are amazing. I will link the recipe down below in the description. But basically it's a beef and pork blend. That's the burger patty. And then there's all different kinds of sauces and um, toppings that you put on top of the burger. So I'm really excited to eat that. I've had it one other time and it's so good. So that's going to be Memorial Day dinner. We also have chips and watermelon and all the good stuff. So that'll be fun. So honestly, before I play this clip, just a warning, this whole thing was a slight fail. I ended up just recording my mom's reaction. It didn't actually get me pouring the orange juice, but that's okay. It was still a really funny reaction. <laughs> so, um, we'll go ahead and play that clip. Pretty good. Good. You weren't in the picture. Dang it. it was Were aiming that way. That? It was aiming that way. <laughs> Wait, is she in it? What? Is I got her reaction. Yeah, but not, All right. not you yeah, throwing it on the ground. That was a fail. <laughs> All right. That's a that's a funny video that's like viral right now is like catching the mom's reactions of like just pouring. <laughs> 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 so we are actually in my old room from high school on a quick little tour feeling a quick little tour coming on honey found me hello so my mom has currently turned this into a guest room so it actually looks really cute in comparison well it looked cute when it was my room too but now it looks really really cute but also my brother has kind of moved his stuff in here and there is now a table of lego stuff so kind of interesting um the legos are not mine promise you guys <laughs> so um let's go and do a quick little tour just a it's a little bit messy because my brother has been hanging out in here but anyway so yeah my mom has totally redone this she's actually put three little twin beds here which i think are so cute here is my old desk area it still has some of my stuff on it those are my senior pictures that little book all of the yearbooks all of this fun stuff some old sorority stuff from college all of that. So a lot of this stuff I just didn't take to my apartment. We got some cute wall paintings right there. So yeah, that's a pretty cute. And we got a chandelier. Let's see as far as the bathroom goes. Oh, my brother not left another little surprise. He brought us some, ooh, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and eat one of those since he left it in my room. Hmm. Probably sour crunchy crawlers. I actually got him these as part of his birthday present. Pretty good. We got the bathroom. Uh, the closet has kind of turned into storage, and we had like all of my old prom dresses and stuff from high school. Ooh, that one is rough. I cannot believe I picked that out. But those are different times. So 
There you go, blast from the past. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> We got the burger in the making. It comes with an egg on top of it. So you know those little potato sticks that you may have eaten as a kid? We didn't have any of those, so I just broke up some chips and I think that will work just as well. And then we have the secret sauce. I'm going to take that and I'm gonna drench it. Here is the final plate. We have our Cuban burger with some pasta, watermelon, and french fries. I am so excited. Okay, you guys, so I am going to go ahead and show you my skincare routine. I am finally at home. It's been a long, big, fun day. Also full of a little work, which is what I was doing most of the day and why I did not actually film that portion. But it's been a really good evening and day as well. So now I'm going to cozy up and maybe watch a little TV, just be kind of lazy, probably fold some laundry. But um, I want to show you guys my entire skincare routine that I do almost every evening if I don't get super lazy because it's, you know, we all have those days. <laughs> it happens. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started with that and I'll show you the products that I use and everything that I do. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put my hair up. Got a nice little... <laughs> messy bun going on now. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do, this product I absolutely love and I've just recently discovered it. It is the Bliss Makeup Melt Never Greasy Eye Makeup Removing Gel. This stuff is so cool. Honestly, it's kind of like a pre-wash for your face in a way. A lot of times when I just do my cleanser, I feel like I don't really get everything off because there is so much just makeup and dirt and everything that's in my skin so I kind of like to do two washes and this is good just to get the initial makeup off of my face and then I like to go in with my cleanser and really just cleanse everything away instead of I feel like just rinsing it deeper into my skin I don't think that's a thing but that's kind of how it feels so I kind of do two washes what I do to use this is I put a little bit in my hand and I like this a lot more than just normal eye makeup remover because I don't have to call me lazy but I don't have to get the like the little cotton pads and do that whole mess I can just like blend it into my skin maybe you like the whole cotton pad thing and that's fine but like this is just my favorite thing so I go ahead and take this and I just kind of massage it in my skin it really does I'm gonna be closing my eyes here for a second but it really does do a great job of just getting all of the makeup off and I know it says that it's for eye makeup but I love using it all over my face because <laughs> I feel like it just gives me that extra good deep clean of my skin so I'm gonna go ahead and do that I look like a crazy person right now so let's go ahead and rinse Okay, as you can see, my makeup is pretty much completely off my face. So, like, that just in itself really cleans your face, gets it nice and clean. But I also like to use my actual cleanser, which, kind of a confusing story, but it, right now it's in a conditioner bottle. I was, long story short, traveling, and the actual container broke of the face wash, and so this was almost empty, so I just poured it in so that I didn't have to waste it and throw it away because it was brand new. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, if this is not conditioner that I'm gonna be washing my face with, I can't actually remember the name of the cleanser that I use. It's the same brand as this, it's by Bliss. I think it was like the Sensitive Skin one. I will find it and link it in the description below as well if you are curious. But um, this is a face wash that is the same brand as this by Bliss. And I really like it. It is formulated for sensitive skin. And I think it's like rose gold something because it does kind of have a rose gold look to it. So I really like this. I just discovered this brand at Walgreens pretty recently. I'm going to go ahead and also wash my face with this. Okay, you guys, I promise this isn't sponsored, but this is just a brand that I recently found and I love. This is also by the same brand. I don't use this every single night. This is just kind of if I want to go the extra mile because I do think that it is important to exfoliate your skin at least two to three times a week to make it nice and smooth. So I am choosing tonight to do this. I actually also mentioned this product in my spa video. I 
am seriously in love with it. It makes my skin feel so smooth. It's not a normal exfoliator, it is a microderm abrasion. But the pumice that is in here is just so much more fine than in other exfoliators. So I feel like it really just does a good job of actually exfoliating my skin so much better than other exfoliators. So I love this. It is the Bliss Micro Magic Skin Renewing Skin Renewing Microdermal Microdermal Oh my gosh. Microdermabrasion scrub. I am struggling to say that. But this stuff is awesome. So with that being said, I am going to go ahead and take this. And what I like to do with exfoliators is I like to actually rub it on my skin before getting it wet. I feel like it does a better job of actually exfoliating. So I'm going to go ahead and exfoliate and rinse up as well. I usually don't go this extra with three washes of my skin, but you know, sometimes you just wanna go the extra mile. So that is what I'm doing tonight. So now I'm gonna rinse it. Okay, so now I'm going to be taking this is Avin, Avin, something, thermal spring water. It's really nice, that's all I gotta say. And it feels really nice just whenever I spray it on my skin, this is what it looks like. Purpose of this is it's anti-irritating, and so honestly, I just like it because it feels really nice on my skin. I got it from a FabFitFun box, and so since I got it in there, I'm going to use it. So just use it and spray it on my face, and it feels good. I just kind of feel fancy. I don't know if this actually does anything, but it does feel nice. So anti-irritating, I guess I will have less irritated skin. Okay, you guys, another thing that I love to use is a toner. So this is a Perfect World Age Defense Treatment Lotion with white tea. So this also helps against aging, which if you've seen any of my other videos, you know that I am all about preventing any aging on my skin. I want to look young as long as possible. So, um, this does a good job of that. I'm going to take a little cotton pad, and I'm just going to rub this on my skin, and it's just gonna kind of, I also like it because I do feel like it gets any little extra makeup that is hiding deep into my pores. I feel like it really gets that out, because sometimes I'll look at it, even after washing my face, and there will still be like, you can tell some dirt and makeup on it. And I also like to go on my neck with this, which especially I can see more dirt and makeup because I don't always, yeah, I don't always completely get that when I'm washing my face. So now we are going to use, it's from Origins as well, it's a Perfect World Age Defense Skin Guardian. So this is kind of like a moisturizer, but at the same time, it, its main goal is just age defense. So I really like to, Especially put this around my eyes, which I use my pinky because that is the weakest finger And so that is the best finger to use when you are putting product on around your eyes because then you're less likely to pull so I'm putting this on. I am also making sure that I bring this down to my neck because you also want your neck to look nice as you age as well as your face. So I always bring the product down. Last but not least, another Origins product. I feel like I've only used, I have, I've only used Origins and then Bliss. So half luxury, half drugstore. So there you go. I do believe that Bliss makes moisturizer. I just haven't tried it out because I've already had this. And so maybe I will do that. But if you are looking for a cheaper option, Bliss is drugstore. So you can probably find a good moisturizer with them because I do really like their products. But um, this is the Origins Drink Up Intensive Overnight Mask. This is a basically really intense facial lotion. And so I'm just going to take a little bit of this. And yes, these are all sample sizes. I have the full size products as well, but if you guys know anything about Origins, you know when you buy something, basically you get like three samples with it for free. So whenever I run out of the big products, I just use the smaller sample sizes and those honestly last me quite a bit. So I don't mind it at all. And there we go. We are all officially ready for bed. My skin feels so nice and clean and rejuvenated and I feel like I will be waking up tomorrow feeling so much more fresh. So there you have it.
All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe and hit that thumbs up button. That helps me out as a YouTuber and it would mean so much to me. I post new videos every Tuesday and Friday, so stay tuned for those. Bye, guys.